Hi everybody, my name is Georgie, owner of Gigi Brows UK, and today's video is all about the Tina Davies I Love Ink range. The I Love Ink range is great. It's a very small range, so it isn't overly complicated to use, and they're all pre-modified, which is absolutely fantastic. For me, it's a range that is suitable for all artists, but it's particularly ideal for beginners. It's very easy to assess which pigment you're going to use depending on your client. And they all tend to have either a warm or a very golden tone. So there isn't a very high risk of them discoloring to a cool ashy color. They were originally designed for the use of microblading artists. So the pigment is a little bit on the thicker side. However, it does come with a thin shading solution to dilute the pigment so that it is more suitable for the use of a machine so that it's thin enough to be inhaled by the cartridge. I've broken down each pigment so that I can tell you what the level of opacity is and also whether the pigment is warm or if it's neutral. So without further ado, let's get started and have a look at each one. Ash Brown is an opaque light brown with an ashy mass tone and golden undertones. It will need to be modified using a warm toner if being used on a severely cool undertone client if they are wanting to achieve a healed ashy colour, as otherwise it will discolour to a dramatically cool discoloured eyebrow. Grey is an opaque and extremely ashy cool colour with very mild warm golden undertones. It will need added warmth for cool undertone clients to prevent it from discolouring to a dramatically cool colour. Blonde has a cool mass tone and golden undertones. Iron oxide elements add earthy tones and larger particles into the composition and therefore results will last longer, which is ideal when using such a light shade alone. It will need added warmth for cool undertone clients. Medium brown has medium opacity levels with increased levels of warmth. It's perfect for clients with a cool undertone. Dark brown has high opacity levels with increased levels of warmth but isn't as warm as medium brown. It's perfect for clients with a cool undertone. Bold brown is a very dark brown colour with increased levels of warmth that is actually warmer than dark brown. It's perfect for clients with a cool undertone and has medium opacity levels so will heal more sheer than opaque in nature. Ebony is an extremely dark brown with very high levels of carbon black which provides dramatic levels of very quick saturation upon implantation into the skin and should be used with caution. It isn't as bright in colour or as opaque as the rest of the range due to no titanium dioxide. It will need to be modified with warmth being used in a cool undertone client. I really hope that you've enjoyed today's video and that it's been super helpful. And as always, if you've ever got any comments, feedback or questions, just leave them below. You can always DM me at ggbrowseuk on Instagram, or you can email me georgie at ggbrowse.co.uk. If you liked this video, please press the thumbs up icon and also subscribe to my channel. I upload every Sunday at 8 p.m. and I really hope that the content is very useful for you moving forward. Take care everyone and hopefully I'll see you all soon.